In the bustling city of Cresthaven, there stood a magnificent office building called Sapphire Heights. Within its walls, a remarkable entrepreneur named Victor Remington built his empire, a successful conglomerate spanning various industries. Victor was known for his brilliant business acumen, but he was also notorious for his unconventional methods. Victor Remington, the charismatic and enigmatic leader, had a vision. He believed that true success lay not only in profits but in the integrity and loyalty of his employees. Whispers of his mysterious tests floated through the corridors of Sapphire Heights. Some praised him for his creativity, while others questioned the ethics of his actions. One sunny morning, as the employees settled into their daily routines, they noticed a luxurious wallet lying on the reception desk. To their astonishment, they discovered a considerable sum of cash tucked neatly inside. Curiosity peaked, they gathered around, examining its contents. The news spread like wildfire, reaching every corner of the office. Whispers filled the air as employees debated the origins and purpose of the wallet. Some speculated that it belonged to a wealthy client, while others believed it was a mysterious gift from Victor himself. However, a handful of shrewd individuals suspected that this was one of Victor's infamous loyalty tests. Among them were Sarah, a diligent accountant, and Alex, a talented marketing executive. Sarah was a dedicated employee who had served Sapphire Heights for over a decade. She prided herself on her loyalty and ethical values. When she stumbled upon the wallet, she knew she faced a significant dilemma. Should she keep the money, succumbing to temptation, or should she report it, risking her reputation and potential backlash? Alex, a recent addition to Sapphire Heights, had heard rumors of Victor's tests. Intrigued by the challenge, he decided to delve deeper into the mystery. He gathered clues, spoke to colleagues who had experienced previous tests, and pieced together a remarkable theory. Victor planted the wallet to test the loyalty and integrity of his employees. Sarah and Alex, both aware of Victor's reputation, decided to confront him separately. Sarah, anxious and torn, approached Victor in his opulent office. She presented the wallet, explaining her internal struggle. Victor listened intently, a knowing smile playing on his lips, before sharing a few cryptic words, leaving Sarah more perplexed than ever. Meanwhile, Alex embarked on a clandestine mission to gather evidence. He snooped around the office after hours, following subtle clues left by Victor. Late one night, hidden away in Victor's private sanctuary, he stumbled upon a secret room. Within its walls, he discovered a hidden collection of journals, meticulously documenting every loyalty test conducted by Victor. Alex was overwhelmed by what he read in the journals. Though Victor's intentions seemed noble at first, he soon realized the emotional toll these tests took on the employees. Some succumbed to greed, while others faced internal struggles, leading to broken relationships and shattered trust. It was clear that Victor's methods, though thought-provoking, had unforeseen consequences. Armed with newfound knowledge, Alex confronted Victor. He challenged the entrepreneur's motives, demanding an end to these loyalty tests. He revealed that his initial motivation was to create a team bound by loyalty and integrity, but he had lost sight of the cost it imposed on his employees. Upon realizing the harm he had caused, Victor promised to make amends. He vowed to rebuild trust within Sapphire Heights and create a supportive environment that nurtured loyalty organically. Together with Sarah, Alex spearheaded a series of initiatives to foster a culture of trust, transparency, and growth. Years passed, and the echoes of Victor's loyalty tests faded into memory. Sapphire Heights thrived under the new leadership, becoming an exemplar of ethical business practices. Victor, having learned from his mistakes, focused on philanthropy and dedicated himself to mentoring young entrepreneurs. The employees felt valued and motivated, and the company's success reached new heights. However, remnants of Victor's loyalty tests continued to haunt some of the employees. Nathan, a dedicated project manager, had been with Sapphire Heights for several years. Despite the positive changes, he couldn't shake off the effects of the previous loyalty tests. The memory of the wallet incident still lingered in his mind, causing him to question his own loyalty and integrity. He couldn't help but wonder if he would have passed Victor's test or fallen victim to temptation. Nathan's doubts grew stronger each day, affecting his performance and relationships with his colleagues. He felt trapped in a web of insecurity, unsure of his own character and values. Seeking guidance, he reached out to Sarah, who had experienced a similar struggle in the past. Sarah empathized with Nathan's plight and reassured him that true loyalty and integrity couldn't be measured by a single test. She shared her own journey of self-discovery and explained that it was the choices one made every day that truly defined their character. Nathan found solace in her words and resolved to confront his fears head-on. Determined to find closure, Nathan decided to embark on a personal challenge. He would create his loyalty test, 
one that would help him understand the strength of his own character and restore his confidence. He spent days brainstorming and finally came up with a plan. Nathan meticulously prepared a situation that would put his loyalty and integrity to the test. He devised a scenario where he would stumble upon a lost USB drive containing confidential company information. The drive would have the potential to bring harm to Sapphire Heights if it fell into the wrong hands. One afternoon, as Nathan walked through the corridors of Sapphire Heights, he noticed a flash drive lying on the floor. His heart raced as he recognized it, a perfect replica of the one he had planted. Doubts and temptations flooded his mind, but he knew that this was his chance to prove his loyalty to himself. Nathan picked up the flash drive, his hand trembling. In that moment, he reflected on the lessons he had learned from Sarah, Alex, and the aftermath of Victor's tests. He realized that the true test of loyalty wasn't about resisting temptation in an artificial setting, but about consistently making the right choices, no matter how small or unnoticed they might seem. With newfound resolve, Nathan marched to the office of his superior, Thomas, and handed him the flash drive. He explained the situation and expressed his commitment to the company's values. Thomas, impressed by Nathan's integrity, commended him for his honesty and dedication. Nathan's choice to do the right thing had a profound impact on him. It not only restored his confidence but also earned him the respect and trust of his colleagues. Inspired by his actions, other employees began to reflect on their own values and the importance of making ethical choices in their daily lives. Word of Nathan's loyalty test reached Sarah, Alex, and the rest of the leadership team. They were moved by his courage and growth. Recognizing the lingering effects of Victor's tests, they decided to take proactive steps to ensure that no employee would experience the same doubts and insecurities. Under their guidance, Sapphire Heights implemented a comprehensive ethics training program. It focused on nurturing values such as integrity, empathy, and social responsibility. The program aimed to equip employees with the tools to make ethical decisions and foster a supportive environment where they could thrive both personally and professionally. As Sapphire Heights continued to prosper, its success became synonymous with ethical leadership. The company's commitment to fostering loyalty and integrity became a model for other organizations. Nathan's personal journey served as a reminder that growth and redemption were possible even in the face of past mistakes. The legend of Victor Remington's wallet may have sparked initial controversy, but it ultimately led to a transformation within Sapphire Heights. The lessons learned helped reshape the company's values and establish a new era of ethical leadership, where loyalty and integrity were nurtured, rather than tested. And so, the story of Nathan's personal test and Sapphire Heights' journey toward redemption concluded, leaving a lasting legacy of growth, compassion, and ethical decision-making for all who pass through its doors.